We have to have a lifelong learning attitude that we are constantly in the learning mode. And and with AI, I'm going to preface this with uh, specifically generative AI. Uh, people are finding more ways and better ways to use it. And I think, like Alina mentioned earlier, you know, there's several tools out there that you would use. You have to understand how to use them. That could be the first um, new skill that you pick up is how to use these tools. Because you, you just can't, you know, you won't get much out of them if you're using ChatGPT for search. So, um, you know, it's, it's a combination of these tools. You have to know what the different uh, LLMs bring to the table, what's the difference between Gemini, Claude, and ChatGPT, what they do best, and use those tools. So that's a, a learning opportunity there. And also uh, other tools, like uh, I'm on board, I use Clip perplexity as well and so i find that very valuable so you have to understand what tools you're using and why you use them and then on the on the other side um, uh, dr tanya mentioned being able to pivot you have to be you have to have some manner of subject expertise in what you're doing to be able to ascertain if the ai is actually delivering the, the knowledge that you need and you know that it is correct because as we know these tools tend to get things wrong so you need to be have understanding of what you're doing to, to know what is correct. You can use it properly. So.